leave your iMessage red receipts on? Because that seems like su super personal for a lot of people. You know, I don't. Um, sometimes I get okay. hit with questions that take a little bit more thought. And I want to be able to respond in a way um, that is clear, concise. And what I don't want to happen is for anyone that works with us and works for me thinks that I'm ignoring them because that's absolutely not the case. I don't want to bring any kind of doubt into people's minds because then it, it doubts them wanting to engage me with a question or a suggestion and things of that nature, if that makes sense. So, no, I, I don't turn my read receipts on. Um, I don't do that on a personal level. I don't do that in a business level because I think it just kind of sends the wrong message to folks. Well, now you got me you questioning think? whether I should have it on. Uh, <laughs> so for me, I, I'll leave them on because uh, most of the people, I say most of the people who, who know me know that I will get back to them. But again, you know, I guess, you know, a lot of the times I preface that, like, hey, if you see that I read it, just know that I read it. I'll get back to you when I can. Uh, but I'm not yeah. ignoring you. So always do have to preface that just so people understand. Because in technology, yeah. uh, this technology world, it's definitely, uh, if you don't get a, uh, a message back from especially someone you're dating or someone in your family within, you know, four or five hours, like where the where, where are you at, you know, questions start coming up. And same thing for business. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, if you're, uh, if you're expected to respond to somebody kind of gets that, um, that expectation down. So yeah, I use, uh, yeah. I use red receipts for me, like, just so people know, I see it. Yeah, for me, and maybe this is the case for a lot of people out there. If I read something, then I may not come back to it, not be intentionally, but I use that little dot right. on the iMessage or the unread message in my emails, like my to-do list. And so at the end of the day, or first thing in the morning, you know, I'll go through that because to me, that just means people are waiting on things for me. Some are obviously more right. timely than others. You message, you can see it on your screen and you can read, you know, 95% of it if it's not a really long message. But I also kind of use it as a tool that reminds me of the things that I need to do. So if I read it, that little dot goes away and it's just kind of those little things like, <laughs> for me that makes all yeah.